Hola people, welcome back to my channel Life Science. Fantastic. As promised, in today's video, I'll be talking everything about bioinformatics, that is MSc in bioinformatics. And now, those who are new to this channel, I welcome you all. Plus, I request you to watch my introduction video so that you'll get an idea about this channel. Now, what are we waiting for? Let's get started. If I introduce you all to this course, then MSc Bioinformatics is a master's course which deals with management of data in modern biology and medicine. In simple words, it is a combination of biology and computational technology. Now, if I talk about the duration of the course, then MSc in Bioinformatics is a two-year postgraduate course available in colleges or universities of India. The eligibility criteria for MSc Bioinformatics is students should have a bachelor's degree in any life science subject with minimum 50 to 60 percentage. Now let's move to the admission process. <laughs> some colleges have direct or merit-based admissions, but on the other hand, some colleges conduct their own entrance exams. Students applying for this course needs to qualify these entrances for admissions. <laughs> Now, if you want to know which colleges or universities have entrance exams, then here is a list for you guys. Let's talk about the fees for the course. The fees ranges from 20,000 to 3 lakhs per year. Basically, the fees clearly depends on the college or the university you select. Mm, intro is done, duration is done, admission process is done, uh, fees is done. Now I guess it's time to cover the syllabus of the course. The syllabus of MSc Bioinformatics may cover subjects like data structure and algorithms, fundamentals of programming languages, essential mathematics and statistics, genomics and proteomics, microbiology and biotechnology, fundamentals of bioinformatics, Java programming and software applications, database management systems, etc. Such subjects will be divided into four major semesters and the last semester will include your project. Here is a list of some colleges and universities offering this course. Moving on to the last but very important segment that is the future scope, job opportunities and the salary after getting a degree in this. MSc Bioinformatics jobs are available in both private and public organizations. There are ample job opportunities for bioinformaticians out there. You can actually work as bioinformatics analyst, bioinformatics trainer, biostatistician, assistant professor or JRF, that is junior research fellow. To be very, very honest, major pharmaceutical, biotechnology and software companies are looking to hire professionals with skills and experience in bioinformatics, where they're working with large amount of biological and healthcare information. If I talk about the salaries for the jobs like this, then guys, trust me, bioinformaticians have the highest starting salary. I mean, a bioinformatician fresher earns the highest among all other life science subject students like biotechnology or microbiology or biochemistry, etc. The salary for bioinformatics or bioinformatician ranges from 5 lakhs per annum to 6 lakhs per annum. This is just the starting salary they'll get. So if you ask me, this is a very good career option after your BSc in life science subject. <laughs> That's it for today. Hope I was able to clear all your queries or questions about MSc in bioinformatics. Um, stay tuned for my future videos and then bye-bye guys. Toodles! <laughs>